is uncovering a safety warning for people living in condos and apartment buildings. The fire sprinkler system may be defective. IT team investigator Jared Holbrook shows us what he's uncovered tonight. Jared? Well, Jameson, this billion dollar lawsuit claims that manufacturers knowingly installed defective pipes in buildings across the country and potentially put thousands of lives in danger. It is a major life safety issue. Florida attorney Irvin Gonzalez says it's a life safety issue because the orange pipes and fire sprinkler systems known as CPVC are defective and shouldn't have been sold to the public. He says the resin and plastic CPVC pipes break down and fail when it comes in contact with common building products like bonding agents and anti-corrosive materials and metal pipes that lead into the CPVC system. He's seen pipes and fire sprinkler systems break or leak, which can also affect water pressure during a fire emergency. It's not a question of if it will happen, it's a question of when it will happen. Just look at the millions of dollars in damages at two South Florida high-rise condos. We've hired a number of uh, nationally recognized experts, engineers, chemists, material experts who have gone to the lab, tested this material, and have determined that it's defective, it's not suitable for what is being sold, it will fail. To make matters worse, Gonzalez says companies knew about it since 2005, but kept selling it anyway. In his billion-dollar class action lawsuit, he states emails from the largest manufacturer of the CPVC show they tested the product and knew it was defective. It's a classic case of putting profits over people and sales over safety. Now we're looking into just how widespread this problem could be, even right here in the Tampa Bay area. We'll have that part of our story tonight at 11. I'm investigator Jared Holbrook, taking action for you.